As you can see, I'm on top of the world. Can see absolute diddly. Hi, I'm James from Sussex Outdoors. Welcome to another video. Day two out in the Breckens, and I'm not alone. I'm here with Warren at Lindley 360. He is my guide for the weekend. We, uh, we came down from one mountain earlier today. We sat and decided where we were gonna go, and now we're walking back up another one. Oh. It's absolutely beautiful. It's not too cold. Yeah, a bit of a spitty rain, misty rain. But, and my legs hurt. <laughs> but you can't grumble. You can't grumble. Enjoy. Well, we're halfway up, and I believe it's called Minor Trod. Oh, we are, whoop. We've come all the way out that way, and we've still got, oh, up there to go. About another hour, 40 minutes, hour of hiking. I'm definitely unfit. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear me with the wind. But we've just come, we've got to the top, almost to the top, we've just come round on the ridge and the wind's just whistling through, but yeah. I've been told by my esteemed guide, who's behind me somewhere there, that we've got about another 50 contours, so about another 50 metres up about another hundred metres that way. It's a steep climb. Nearly there though. I'm hot but I'm cold. I'm thirsty but I'm sweating. There we go. I don't know. Anyway, we're going to carry on. See you in a bit. <laughs> nice one, mate. That's good. That's good. It's good. <laughs> oh. Well, look at this beautiful landscape. Oh. We're on over there, so there we go. Look, even I'm, I'm literally four meters away from the tents and even they you, they look like they're in cloud but yeah we're all we're all pitched we're quite close together we've got the doors opposite each other so we can pass stuff to us the wind is coming from roughly where Warren's disappearing into the mist uh, so yeah the uh, yeah should be able to cook just here and uh, not be not be in the wind but yeah thankfully the uh, the rain has stopped for the second, so yes, I've got my down jacket on, but not needing the uh, the rain jacket yet. But yeah, this is going to be an interesting evening because I don't know if you can see, but the pegs we've had to put the pegs in incredibly, incredibly shallow 
because we are literally sitting on about two, three inches of turf and it's granite underneath. So hopefully the wind won't pick up too much tonight. I hope not. Oh, but yeah, we've um, we pitched, we've had a, a coffee and a hot chocolate. Well, Warren's had a hot chocolate, I've had a coffee. And uh, yeah, now it's a case of I'm gonna start getting the bed set up because the ground is cold. I'm sitting on a on a little um, little mat, but I can feel the cold through it. So yeah, gonna get the bed up, get sat down and uh, and warm up. Yeah. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Three, two, one. There we go. Nice. Can we reach? I wonder I'm, if we can. We should be able to. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Cheers. Through the cloud. I'm on. Uh, it's a Northern Monk, Faith Northern in Monk. Futures, and uh, Smug. Smug. It's called. A Northern Monk Smug. A Northern Monk Smug. Are oh, yeah. you smug in your tent? I think so. Yes. Yeah, nice. Yeah. I got the old spare <laughs> tent, of course. So. <laughs> cheers. Mm. Cheers. Oh. Tonight's dinner is a little bit of a mishmash. We're going to be having chili and rice. So I've got a, a tin of Morrison's chili con carne. But I'm going to bulk it out with a Dolmio stir in smoked bacon and tomato sauce. And then to add some kick to it, I have a little tub here of chipotle chili paste that we can add for extra zing. Um, my esteemed colleague over there has got the uh, the microwave rice that he's going to be warming through while I get all this together. Dinner has been prepared. Like I say, the, uh, the, the Mr. Brand has actually got the, uh, the the rice underneath the chili. Yeah, mine's the right way yeah, up. <laughs> where, where with mine, mine is, is the wrong way round. I've got the chili under the rice, but it just worked out easier so we didn't have to dirty too many pans. Oh, dinner grubs up and it's uh, nice and warm. Oh, that's going to warm me up. Oh, yeah, it's also going to make my nose run. <laughs> See in a bit. Oh, well, we ate dinner, we laid down, and then both of us fell asleep for a bit. <laughs> So yeah, uh, gonna call it a night. It's coming up to 11 o'clock anyway, so. I'm gonna go zip everything up. I shall see you in the morning. Good night. Good morning, campers. Cracking night's sleep, to be fair. I was up at about five for a wee, and then went back. But yeah, slept all the way through. The weather is uh, is not as bad as it was uh, yesterday. The, uh, the clag does seem to be clearing, and I can see some sunlight in the distance. It's not a myth. <laughs> anyway, we've got the kettle on. We're gonna have a coffee, and then uh, then discuss about what uh, what the plans are and possibly I'll do some breakfast. Oh, you can tell it's cold, you can see the steam. Well, we've got breakfast of champions again this morning, so spam and egg McStuffins. So yeah, I'm gonna get uh, get cracking with that. It's a little later than it was yesterday for breakfast, so yeah, we've got to, got to cook, pack, and then get on the road. There we go, my, uh, my spam is, is on. And because it was a bit of an overload in the pan yesterday, we've divvied it up. So Warren is doing his over there. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll just do our own portions this morning. Oh, the spam is going well, as is, We're as is well. Warren's. We're good. So the first time the uh, Circus Outdoor Spice Kit has arrived in Wales. There we go. So we shall get some um, what's left of the sage. And I will, I'm going to add half of this onto mine without the wind blowing it off. And I'm going to pass the rest to Warren. Oh nice, yeah, got it. So to sprinkle on. Yeah, literally sprinkle on and let it, uh, let it do its thing. I'm going to video that, I'm going to <laughs> Up. 
but the, the sage just brings out the flavour, doesn't it? It does. Yeah. It does. Well, breakfast is finished. We are. Uh, well, I'm making a, a, a last coffee before we pack up. Warren's on uh, washing up duty. He's, he's playing pot wash. I am pot washer. <laughs> and uh, yeah, then we're going to start packing up and um, shipping out. And say so it's uh, the sun's been trying to make an appearance. We get the odd the odd ray of sun coming through up here. So hopefully it'll be a nice uh, nice morning to uh, trot down the hill. Well, here we are out and about. We're just doing the packing up. We just made the coffee, so starting to put things away. If I take you this way, I can see it, so, so will you. There's a lake down there. And the fact that we've got sunshine, the fact that we arrived in Clag last night and we left in Clag yesterday morning from the other peak, it's so nice to have a bit of sunshine. This is us, all packed up. We were both here, leave no trace. Oh. Yeah, so now we're taking a slightly different route down. Back to the car, back to civilization. It's been an absolutely beautiful time here. Absolutely beautiful. This is us, last of the main steps from coming down from the mountain. <sighs> so not far to go back to the car. So I would like to say thank you ever so much, Warren. Oh, good. For We've a had a cracking day. Yeah. Uh, cracking two days. Yeah, you? fantastic yeah, yeah. opportunity. Thank yeah, yeah, you yeah. so, so much. Pleasure. It's been absolutely amazing. <laughs> We done well. How did we walk up there? <laughs> we did. <laughs> we did. And down again. And down again, yeah. So I'd like to say thank you ever so much for watching. And from me and Warren in the Brecon Beacons, see you on the next one. Bye bye. <laughs>